Good morning, Mr. Rogan. I'm Ryan. I'm leader of Group 1. And here, I have the number one problem. Find to a negative number with a sum of 18 such that the sum of their squares is a good one. For our solution, step 1. Represent the unknown quantities as variables. In x should be the first number and x 18 minus x be the second number. So, here's the two equations. I, I got x plus y is equal to 18 and s, s of x is equal to x squared plus y squared as x of x is the minimum value. For, not, for step 2, write the primary function to be minimized. So s, s of x is equal to x squared plus substitute the value of y with, which is 18 minus x raised to 2. 18 times 2 is equal to, 18 raised to 2 is equal to 324. 18 times negative x is equal to negative 18 x times 2 is equal to negative 36 x. Plus, negative x times negative x is equal to x squared. Therefore, we have h, s of x is equal to 2 x squared minus 36 x plus 324. For step 3, determine the physical domain of the primary function based on the restrictions of the problem. It is given that the sum of the total negative number is 18. Hence, the domain of s of x is equal to 2x squared minus 36x plus 24 is on the interval of 24 from 0 to 18. Step number 4, apply appropriate theorem. The function s of x is equal to 2x squared minus 36x plus 324 is continuous on the interval from 0 to 18. Thus, by the extreme value theorem, s has a minimum value at critical point of f or at an end point of, of the interval 0 to 18. Now find the critical point. s of x is equal to 2x squared minus 36x plus 324. Get the derivative of that. S prime of x is equal to 4x minus 36. 2 times 2 is equal to 4, and 2 minus 1 is equal to 1. So, 4x minus 30, get the derivative of negative 36x is equal to negative 36, and make the constant equal to 0. Therefore, equate the 4x minus 36 to 0. 4x minus 36, 36 is equal to 0. Transpose the negative 36 to right side to get positive 36. Then 4x is equal to 36 and divide both, divide both sides by 4 to get x is equal to 9. Evaluate s of x at x is equal to 9. The interval of from 0 to 18 which is x is equal to 0 and x is equal to 18. By substituting 9 to the given s of x, for s of 9, we got 162. For s of 0, we got 324. And for x, s of 18, we got 324. By observing that, as you notice, the minimum value goes around the s of 9, which is 162. Therefore, the minimum value of the function is 162. At x is equal to 9. The value of x is equal to 9 is the first number. To find the second number, we substitute this into 18 minus x. 18 minus x is equal to 18 minus 9 and 18 minus 9 is equal to 9. Therefore, the two numbers that give a minimum sum of squares are 9 of and 9. Rx is 9 and y is 9. 9 plus 9 is equal to 18. 9 squared plus 9 squared is equal to 81 plus 81 is equal to 162, which is our minimum value. Thank you.